Welcome to the Translator's Guide. In this video, you will learn about the usage, features, and types of corpora and corpus software. Let's start with the definition of corpus. A corpus is essentially a collection of written texts or transcribed speech that is compiled for linguistic research. These texts are typically stored in a digital format to facilitate easy access and manipulation. Corpora is essential for translators because by learning how to use these tools, translators can develop a deeper understanding of language, enhance their research skills, and improve their ability to produce accurate and context-sensitive translations by providing real-world examples of language usage. Corpora serves various purposes in the translation process such as terminology research, language study, and comparative analysis. In terminology research, translators can explore how specific terms, language registers, or jargon are used in context which is crucial for accurate and context-appropriate translations. Language study allows translators to understand the nuances, idiomatic expressions, and stylistic elements of a language, enhancing the quality and target-orientedness of translation. Comparative analysis is done by examining how certain structures are translated in bilingual or multilingual corpora, translators can gain insights into different translation strategies and procedures. There are several types of corpora that are used in translation studies. Monolingual corpora are collections of texts in a single language. It's used for studying linguistic features like vocabulary, syntax, and collocations within a language. Bilingual corpora contains parallel texts in two languages. This is particularly useful for translators as it provides direct examples of how specific terms or phrases are translated. Multilingual corpora are similar to bilingual corpora, but include texts in multiple languages. This is beneficial for comparative linguistic analysis across different languages. Specialized corpora focuses on a specific subject area or genre, providing translators with relevant examples and terminology in specialized fields. Ad hoc corpora are custom-built corpora that are assembled specifically for a particular translation project or research question. Unlike standard corpora, which are pre-compiled and cover a broad range of topics or genres, ad hoc corpora are tailored to suit the specific needs of a translator or researcher. To analyze corpora, we need to use corpus tools. Corpus tools are software applications designed to analyze corpora. These tools have several functionalities such as concordant search, word frequency lists, collocation analysis, keyword analysis, and term extraction. Concordant search enables searching for specific words or phrases within the corpus to observe their usage in various contexts. Word frequency is a method of generating lists of the most frequently used words or phrases in the corpus, which helps understand common language patterns. Collocation analysis is done by identifying common collocations, which are the words that frequently appear together, and providing insights into natural language usage. Keyword analysis can be useful for finding terms that are unusually frequent in a text compared to a reference corpus, which can be crucial in identifying key concepts and terminology in specialized texts. Term extraction is the process of extracting terminology from the text by analyzing the frequency and morphological features of the words and the usage of the words in the given text. Another important aspect of corpus studies is the visualization. There are various ways of visualizing the data from the corpus, such as word tree, word cloud, concordance list, concordance mosaic, and frequency list. Corpus tools help us to analyze the corpora. Some of the best known tools are wordsmith tools, antconc, Sketch Engine, and NLTK. Wordsmith Tools is a proprietary software that is made for Windows. It offers a suite of modules for detailed linguistic analysis, including concordance, word list, and keyword analysis. Users only have access to their corpus, which is stored on their computer. Antconc is a popular user-friendly freeware tool that provides concordance search, collocation analysis, word, keyword, and n-gram lists. Sketch Engine is a web-based application that works on a subscription model. 
It has its own cloud-based multilingual corpora and offers a range of functionalities, including word sketches, term extraction, thesaurus, word cloud, and collocation list. Sketch Engine can be used for creating and analyzing large monolingual and multilingual corpora. NLTK, the Natural Language Toolkit, is an open-source Python library for natural language processing. NLTK comes with pre-built functions and utilities for ease of use and implementation. It is one of the most popular libraries for natural language processing and computational linguistics. Corpora and Corpus tools represent a significant advancement in translation studies. These resources provide translators with access to authentic language usage, facilitating more accurate and contextually appropriate translations. By learning these tools, translators can effectively address complex linguistic challenges and meet the evolving demands of the translation industry. We hope you enjoyed the video and learned the details of Corpora and Corpus tools. If you like the video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and like the video.